This is a screencast for how to record movement on the smart board and then how to play it back in a loop form so that it can go continuous for you. So the first thing you'll need to do is um, get the smart recorder from the tools. So I'm going to use my floating tools on the left hand side here. And I've already pulled it in, it looks like this. But if yours is not in that choice, you can go to settings and it will be right in here and you can click on it and drag it out and drop it so that you have the recorder on your toolbar. Then I'm done with this and what I want to do now is activate the recorder so I'm going to click on that and it will come up in the corner and I can move it where I need to and then I'm going to start recording by clicking the record button. I can click to record the full screen or I can drag and record to do part of the screen. I'm just going to click to do the full screen. And I can see up here that it's recording. And I'm on my computer, so my handwriting is not going to be great, but I will try um, to get a pen and do some recording of my handwriting. <laughs> yeah, it's not going to happen. But you get the idea. So I'm recording my movements with my pen. <laughs> Not sure what that's supposed to be, but um, there we go. We've got some movement happening. So then I'm going to go back and stop the recording by clicking on the little square. And my recording is ready to play. So I can play it just from here and it will play just the single recording. If I'd like to make it loop, I want to go up to View and click Loop. So it's under the View menu that you find Loop. And then when I hit play, it will show you what I've done with my red pen, and then it will play that again. And as you can see down here, it's showing as it moves through the recording. And then it will just start right over again at the beginning. And it will do it again. That's it.